What's up, everybody? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to the new subscribers. Welcome back to the old subscribers. I am doing, um, by request, uh, what is really going on spreads for all of the signs I'm going to be doing by elements, and I am on the air signs. <clears throat> So there's a few different parts to this spread. It goes over kind of like what this is, why it's like that, um, what's being said. The underlying factor, um, something that is unknown in the best way forward. Air signs, your underlying energy was take the lead and unleash your creativity. Something about... Um, this connection is causing you to kind of figure your shit out in a way. Um, figuring out what it is that you're good at and moving forward in that energy. What is this? Three of Pentacles in reverse. Something where you guys just weren't working together. Communication could have been off. Um, why is it like this? Two of Pentacles in reverse. Um... I feel like someone made a decision. Someone is trying to maybe not juggle so much in their life. They're trying to be grounded, um, you know, work on one thing at a time, keep their focus on certain things. Um, what's being said, the strength card in reverse. The underlying factor is the Ace of Cups. Um, Someone just really didn't want to put up with the third parties, the talking to other people, the juggling, you know, um, really not having a whole lot of confidence in this. And I think that um, the problem is, is there's love here. Is the problem self-love or is the problem that, you know, you guys genuinely love each other, but it's just not really going anywhere? Something that is unknown. Uh, this person is your twin. Best way forward is the Nine of Pentacles and the Two of Swords in reverse. Um, they're basically telling you that the best way forward right now, even though there's definitely strong love connection here, is to kind of do things on your own. Um, establish yourself, whether it's in a business or in life. And, you know, knowing that this person is probably meant for you, but it's, it's up to them to make that decision. I think that um, there's something about you guys choosing yourself and working on yourself and moving away from this that's going to cause this person to make this decision to stop juggling, to stop, you know, doing a whole bunch of things and kind of maybe express their feelings to you. Um, because I feel like um, it's a need to not be so rugged and... Um, aloof to your emotions when they're obviously here for whoever I'm talking to. Your guys' sign is Can't Sleep by Elijah Blake featuring Kaja, K-A-I-J-A. So we're going to see what else is kind of going on in this situation for some of you guys. Um, is it wrong that I still don't know my heart? If your love was a drug... You're the one with the trigger. You have playful communication, respect, twin flame, pleasure, trigger. Some of you guys are dealing with an Aries or somewhere with Aries in your chart. You have good luck. You have projection. You have believe. What I never said. Obstacles. And heart too big. I guess my loyalty got used against me. And then it says death. Things need to change. I need to change. I am changing and letting old shit go. So for some of you guys, I feel like this was a, this, bleh, this was a really um, physical attraction, physical connection. For some of you guys, this was like someone who kind of played with your emotions. Someone who, you know, you guys probably had really good sex, but it's like you're wanting more than that. You're wanting this person to figure out that the reason that you've been triggered so much, the reason why there's been so much projection is it's not about the pleasure and the playing around and the communication. It's basically, you know, someone wants there to be respect. Someone wants there to be loyalty. Someone wants this person to figure out what it is that they want um I feel like someone's definitely overthinking this um someone has some 
um, up all night, not sleeping, um, anxiety type of energy. Um, I feel like someone wants to open up, but they didn't in the past. And I think that was probably a blockage. I think someone does want to open up to, uh, but it's just like there isn't any communication or there's just not a whole lot of movement. Um, you have Ice King. You have Gifts. Blonde female, and you have freedom, you have bl <laughs> brunette female, and you have twin flame. Some of you guys needed to make a decision between two people. Some of you guys are figuring out who your true twin flame is, and it's not the person that you chose or that you're currently with. Um, some of, someone has a really immature kind of way of doing things. I feel like they don't really like to take things seriously. Um, but there is energy of someone making a plan, someone, um, spending a lot of time, um, writing their things and their thoughts and uh, things down. But the problem is, is there is, there is a sense of betrayal here by someone's friends could have gotten involved. Someone maybe said something, someone kind of threw salt in the game here. Um, I feel like there's just definitely enemy energy here, and I feel like some of you guys may have believed either what this person said or believed that I think that, you know, they projected or um, gave this illusion like they were your twin when really they weren't. And now this person has to figure out what they're going to do now because I feel like there's definitely someone who um, is getting recognized, um, maybe making a lot of money. But there's a sense of greed here, and I think that they're figuring out maybe the person that they're with is with them for the wrong reasons. Someone could be going back to school. I do feel like there's some type of wish here that is coming true, and someone is kind of needing to take a chance on this um, and maybe taking the advice from something. There's something that is going to be coming out in this, the month of July, and it says it is time to act on this. And then it says spiritual development in line, <laughs> enlightenment, awareness, and understanding. Someone could be going through a, a spiritual awakening. And then it says good news. Um, it says have faith. There's cycles. Build on solid ground. Engage in higher reason. Make a plan. Look forward. Laugh at your demons and ask with sincerity um something you've asked the universe for something you've been working on something you've been manifesting um be aware of the people around you that might not have the greatest of intentions for you or your life or your plan um maybe not being so open to telling everyone what it is that you're working on um facing your demons a little bit head on knowing that some of you guys are in a very karmic cycle and you know it's important to have faith but it's also important for you to figure out what it is that you're good at here and moving forward in that energy you know um there's some friends here that don't have the greatest intentions for you some of these some of these people could have told you a bunch of bullshit and you believed it and it could have um, potentially wrecked a connection um, for whatever reason and I think that um, someone is figuring out you know um, who they truly have feelings for and maybe the issues that held this connection back in the past was you know maybe you guys were on different pages maybe somebody just wanted sex and in turn they're Someone did end up catching feelings now that someone isn't communicating with them anymore and um, someone needs to get themselves out of a current situation that they're in with someone who's pretty karmic because um, you're figuring out that person wasn't your twin. You thought they were your twin, but they're not. And now you're like, well, shit, maybe I made the wrong decision. And it's about figuring out, you know, who you really genuinely have feelings for and who maybe um you thought you did or you thought it was something else or just a lot of like miscommunication here it looks like um because i think someone is used to doing things on the own on their own but then they were challenged by this energy of this person that came into their life and it's causing them to boss up a little bit and then in turn possibly you know freeing themselves and taking their power back and moving in that energy. So that's all I have for the air signs. Have a good night.